Yay, light sharding it up in this piece. That's a light shard made out of crystal. Wonderful. There's only one piece left, Uncle. Yup. Huh? Oh, haven't you heard? About the end of the world? The Hypno Baron is summoning a creature of unspeakable horror. Behold! The creature of unspeakable horror! Okay. Noise. Oh, he will be. You see, I summon him here to obtain his merchandising right. Say what? Squid Baron axe and mugs and t-shirts. Crew necks and raglins? Tanya, what's a raglan? Daughter of the Genies, welcome to the Genie Realm. Take this transformation and enter the light. I got a harpy dance. Okay. Come on, harpy. Oh, I can float. That's interesting. Why are they slidey? Whatever, I don't want to know about it. Let's go. Congratulations! You've thwarted evil five times in a single day! That's gotta be a new personal best. Being a genie? That's only half hero. Sure isn't easy. I know what you meant, and thanks. But now, I really owe it to Uncle to get that final component. So, what is it anyway, Uncle? According... <laughs> I filmed the French... The, the, the cheesy French accent. According to... <laughs> according to this. <laughs> according to this. Oh dear. Hmm. The blueprint shows a hand crank mechanism, but that's no good. Here, where your old uncle gets his chance to shine. Oh, here's where your old uncle gets his chance to shine. Uh, that's right. We are going to improvise. Huh? Why do you always think hacky German accents are hacky Russian accents? If I was doing a hacky Russian accent, I'd be like, <laughs> Why turn the wheel? <laughs> Why turn the wheel at all when you can ring up a hamster wheel? <laughs> to do the work for us. What are you talking about? That is my, that is my hacky Russian accent. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, that's what, I'm, what does it sound like? Buddy, you do not talk to me this way. <laughs> My mom says I sound like a, a Jew. Like a Hasidic Jew. Why turn the wheel at all when you can ring up the hamster wheel? <laughs> and do the work for us. Anyway. I don't know. That sounds like bad news for some hamster. I never said I could do accents great. <laughs> Not like I go to Russia and use my accent and they'll be like, Buddy, you sound just like a Russian person. <laughs> oh, you sound just like a Russian person. I, I don't know the difference between... Buddy, you just... Your Russian is so great. Mm. It's horrible. Anyway, hey, I know if I, if I could speak a good German accent, I'd probably be better at speaking regular German. A regular hamster would get tired and need to rest, right? 
but a zombie hamster will happily run all day long. Brilliant! Brilliant! It's settled then. The zombie hamster will will be our perpetual energy source. <laughs> I can't do the, the accents anymore. <laughs> energy source. source. <laughs> This is becoming increasingly hard. It, it's it's touching a part of my brain I'm not very good at. I I, I need to stretch out my my uh, fake accent part of my brain. Tanya, you do you do research on brain parts. Which one is responsible for doing fake accents? <laughs> None of it. So what if somebody got in a coma and woke up speaking? a different language or speaking in a different accent or something like that. What part of their brain would have been affected? The tree, the tree farter? Prefrontal cortex, that's a little too... I know what that is, anyway. And I'll forge the hamster wheel out of iron to reduce the heat on this little monster's toes. We're seriously going with this plan? <sighs> okay, Rowdy Tops. This sounds like this is your department. Where can I find a zombie hamster? Don't know. How about I just get a regular one and bite it? I think that's how Poe got his. Your brother already has a zombie hamster. Why didn't you just say so in the first place? <laughs> Ugh. What about the iron slab? For that, you need to ask around town. Got it. The zombie hamster and one iron slab coming right up. Alright. Weird. Anyway. This little kid knows about, uh... Oh! I just saw the Azure Knight over at the item shop. Well, that's good. Because I totally have a sword. You gonna make me fight over it? I'm wondering what I, who I give the damn sword to. I mean, he's about as blue as Azure can be. Azul! I am uh, the Azure Knight. You! You were sent forth by the Crimson Knight to retrieve his regal headwear? I would not yield it to a knave such as Yon. How even stands? I would be inclined to bequeath it to you. Shall thine providest me with a fine vorporal blade doused in the tears of the saddened newborn orangutan? Thou might procure said blade by descending to the ocean depths, into the putrid sewers, and to the place where the adventure man will challenge you. If thou art successful in surmounting his cerebral tournament of trickery and deception, and deliver unto me the vorpal, vorpal blade, I still can't say it, before the setting sun touches the vast ocean, the regal headwear shall be thine's. I see thou hast procured the Vorpal Blade. Yay. You are both noble, noble and brave, and so I bestow upon thine thou head thy regal headwear as promised. You got a foxy grandma hat. Where's... <laughs> Damn trucker hat, huh? Fair enough. Where is it upon thine head henceforth? I'm starting to think this is a phony accent. Perchance we shall meet again, my lady of Tress... Tresses Lavender? I mean, I guess that's what it is, huh? Let's see what I can buy with 98 cents. Scimitar. Spin magic to slice posts to spit smithereens with this... High-speed orbiting re weapon. That actually seems pretty cool. I wish you could, like, get more power on your hair, your head whip. I whip my hair back and forth. 
Oh, Grandma, I got just the hat for you. Oh, hey, honey melon. Just me, Grandma Blowfish, same as before. My grandkids are off watching the moving picture shows. Do you think my hat looks too old fashioned? Are you just gonna wear that thing on your head for the rest of your life? My wife bought something for my daughter and then she just ended up wearing it because Christmas, I guess, you know. You know how the kids be like, uh, yeah, I bought a Christmas toy for this girl, but I like it better on me. Like, that's the way my wife is now. She got glasses, red hair, and a headband. She looks like Thelma and Scooby-Doo and Daphne combined. Anyway. Yeah, and you're gonna hand it to her when it looks like Swiss cheese. She's gonna stretch it out with her big head and when she hands it to, <laughs> to my daughter, it's gonna be a necklace. <laughs> She's gonna try to put it on her head. <laughs> and it'll, it'll be hanging all around her shirt. She'll look like one of those mysterious ninjas. <laughs> Like that dude in the background there. Anyway. The grandkids said I need to find a new hat. I don't know. It's something more modern's called for, I suppose. Can you help me out again? Find me a hat that looks nice. I'll wait right here, same as before. Yeah, Foxy Grandma. Foxy. Oh dear. This is what folks are wearing these days? Okay, if you think I should put it on, then here goes. Nice. Foxy Grandma. Oh sweet mama, I look hotter than a fricassee tube worm. Foxy Grandma. Words to live by. This hat is giving this old gal thoughts of springtime if you know what I'm getting at. Uh-oh. I don't want to know. Her, her, her. In fact, I feel, I think I feel a romantic song coming on. Now I hope this ain't too hot and steamy for general audiences. Here it goes. <laughs> Okay, what am I gonna do with the mermaid bubble? Oh dear, now that didn't go to plan. I hope that gives me air so I can use the other dances under the water. That mermaid bubble must have been stuck somewhere deep down inside along with my feelings. No, it did, it did say feelings. Feelings is how black people say it. All up in my feelings. Yes, you do. Now you do. I say feelings. <laughs> Summer tea. <laughs> uh, you got too many. You got too many feelings. <laughs> All up in my feelings. Summer teeth. Summer here and summer there. Look like you floss with a jump rope. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> well, you can keep it. Oh, wow. She just gave me her birth bubble. Thanks, lady. Well, I guess I'm going to the mermaid place so I can do mermaid stuff. Which is good because I was wondering how they're going to let me break blocks underwater. Alright, guys. I'll let you know when I get there. For real, though. I'm not messing with you, lady. Just gonna go this way. All oh, right. Now we get to see what this guy's talking about. <laughs> this place needs a poster. Like an awesome poster. Abner? Eh? Oh, it's the brains on legs. 
You got something for me? Coffee? Brains? Coffee with brains in it? Not really. Then get lost. You're a butt. You're a butt. So... Why do you want a poster? Me and Poe are gonna take this... <laughs> Me and Poe are gonna take this old castle. But I'm concerned about this wall right here. It's screaming for a poster. Totally awesome blacklit poster. Okay. Do I get to find that in here? Probably not. Alright, let's see what, what they want. Oh, nothing. Key. What the hell is that thing? A bat sonar. Oh, you can kill things with a bat. Okay, fair enough. What the hell? What's going on here? Poe. Long time no see. Hello, my lady. I just can't get enough of this castle. Incredible, right? Well, it's a little on the scary side for me. Nah. I could see myself settling down in a place like this. <sighs> you sound a little troubled, Poe. Yeah, it's just my little pet. He doesn't get along with this place at all. He likes to run and run, but around here, I don't know. He could wander off and get hurt, you know? Really want him to have a good time where he can be happy and really get his wiggles out. I know just the place. You do? Really? In that case here. A zo oh, we got a zombie hamster now. Fair enough. I didn't even know I was trying to do that. Aw, isn't he cute? He has a lots he has lots of spunk. He's, he just sold your hamster into slavery, son. So make sure he's got a nice big hamster wheel, wheel to run in, okay? Shua. Transform! Okay, y'all, I think I got everything here. I just know now I need to get a friggin' poster or something, right? But we got the hamster. And that's what I need. You can get a poster, keep that dude in mind. And we were supposed to go to the mermaid place and use the bubble. Ooh, a lot of stuff in that damn mermaid falls, boy. Oh, exactly where I need to go, too. Alright, got one. Come back up with it like it's a shooting game. That's dope. Alright, what's this now? I gotta use the monkey to get up? What is this? Why, why? I'm very confused. What? Do I need to... Eight out of ten. Two more, I guess. Are they all underwater? All 
Alright, let's see what this is about. I, I totally died. This is gonna be a tough one, huh? I don't think it will be tough if I have the bat, right? How am I supposed to get through that area? not gonna work either. How do I get through there? Transform. Okay, so far so good. Do I use this one? Alright. Now what? All right. Got another little secret thingy. Uh, a card? You've got a data chip. All that work for a data chip. I have to head on back. I hate that crap. I'm just gonna kill myself. Death. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Oh, I can use the bat. Okay. Took me a second to figure that out. Alright, handled some stuff. I don't know... what I was supposed to do with it, but I did it. Looking for that's weird. What does it say? Waterfall relic while uh, assuming a water based form. Press up while standing in a waterfall. Okay. Well, that's exactly what I needed. Fair enough. I know exactly where I'm going now. <clears throat> Doesn't it hurt your tail when you drag it across the concrete? Really? That's all I was working for was a damn heart holder? Whatever. What I'm talking about. Why did it take me so long to figure that out? Mm. 
All right. Okay. Well, I guess I can try that again. Oh, I see. What? Are you shitting me? Back gives you light? Okay, whatever. Whatever. Wonder who else gives you light. Oh, that's right, because he had echolocation. So he doesn't have a uh, problem seeing in the dark. Or the bat doesn't. It's not a guy. I can make it through now. damn thing. <laughs> I know they didn't have me running all the way through here just to blankly go through stuff. What the hell? I guess you go down. I did it! Alright, guys! Wow, that was an interesting puzzle. Spider Venom. Now I need to know what Spider Venom does. Blast your foes with acid while in spider form. That doesn't really help me that much, does it? Okay. All right, I forgot that there was a place over here. That mermaid skill in. Looks like P though. Makes ten, right? Ten gallery keys.
I got the iron slab, all right. A little bit of cleanup work there got me, uh, got me what I was looking for. Man, that was, I had no idea how I was supposed to get that iron slab, man. Whatever. 